look at that. You see that little brown guy in my hair? That's an extension. Don't you love it? What's up everyone, I'm Jamie, and today I'm going to show you how I like to make dreadlock hair extensions out of human hair. What, what? If you're new to this channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. I do new videos every single Monday, and we do two other fun videos every week too. Now, I'm going to use human hair. This is hair that I actually cut off of one of my friends, so it's really loose. I just have a little rubber band on the top of it. If you don't have hair that you can use from a friend, you can use weaved in hair too, the kind that's on the weft. That works great for this too. But if you guys are ready to learn, let me show you. You need a clip or a clamp, some rubber bands if you're dealing with loose hair, a comb, and your hair. And I already went ahead and took out a small section of hair about the thickness of my dreadlock and put a little rubber band at the top of it. Now clip that rubber band right to your table. And I'm going to hold the hair in my non-dominant hand and take my comb in my dominant hand, hold it right in the middle. You don't wanna hold the handle or else the end of the comb because it will be too floppy when you're making your teases. Now hold the hair up at a 45 degree angle and I'm going back about three inches and pushing that hair back. Once you do the initial few teases going back, I'm going to go right back in that area that I just teased and do little teases about one inch deep. The tighter the teases you make like this, the more dense your dreadlock will be and it will have such a nice shape. I have friends that have had their dreadlock extensions in for over five years and I made them this way and they lasted a really long time. Once you get down to the end of teasing, I am just going to rake it out, kind of smooth it down with my hands and do the whole process over again, doing little inch teases. Twist the dread a little bit and tease it again. Again, we just really want those knots in there nice and tight. Once you feel like it's nice and tight, I'm going to take it out of the clamp and I'm going to start to roll. Roll, roll, roll. Now, the secret behind rolling your dreadlock is heat and friction. And so I'm going to focus on the same area of the dread right on top for a while. You should be able to feel in your hand it getting a little tighter. Once you feel like it's as tight as it's going to get, move on down the dread, focusing on small little sections of that dread at a time as you roll. Now I'm going to clamp it back down and go back through and tease it up again because as you roll it, those knots start to come loose. This way we can form some more knots in there and do the same process again. Roll it out and roll and roll and roll some more. This is a great arm workout. Now you can leave the ends real loose like this. I want them to be blunted, so I'm just going to go ahead and blunt them up. If you don't know how to blunt your ends and want a more detailed explanation, I did make a video of it the other week, so I'll put the link up in the corner here somewhere. If you do it too much and they become twisted like this, that's okay, just go ahead and roll out your extension again and those twisted ends will start to smoothen out. And again, I am just going to tease it up. Tease, 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 tease. Do this like three or four more times until you feel like your dreadlock is nice and tight and then roll it out. Eventually, you will have a nice tight dread that will be perfect to add to your hair. So what did you guys think? Did you like this tutorial? It was pretty easy. You just have to roll it a lot. If it's still a little bit loose and you want to go through with a crochet hook, you can always crochet it a little bit to tighten it up. I like to wait until I add it to the person's head before I go through and crochet because why do the same step twice? If you guys like this video, make sure to give me a big thumbs up. I will show you how to install it onto your hair next week. Make sure to subscribe so you see that video. Bye everyone. What's up? La 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 la. What's up everyone? I'm Jamie and today, blah. See you next time. Bye. <laughs>